So, hello, good morning here from Bangkok. For my American and English speaking friends, we will make today a mobile from the retailer. It's called Macro, and that's actually the counterpart of uh, Costco in America, where you need a membership or where it used to be people have a membership. We're entering now the main entrance, it's one of the bigger ones here. They have also smaller shops, but this is actually one of the big ones. So let's get a card. They're usually brought back by some staff. Let me go there to the car, parking car area and so on. So that was obligatory, the, the check of the temperature at the entry. Now, hello my back so and here we start first with the TV section you have to deposit your back here at the counter get the number and can when you want uh, get a brochure or what since I'm living here for a long time I can read all these strange letters I don't need that today. So let's first look here on the big entry on the first spot. You come the fans. You need a fan. Without fan in Thailand, you're busted because of the temperature. Right now, outside is feel 40 Celsius. So and here are the normal TVs, Android TV, Samsung. Samsung is good brand here in Thailand even as LG but this is the normal one that's only three four hundred bucks so you see that I've actually I've won one real one I won in a lucky draw from a home supplier there was a TV for three thousand US dollar <laughs> they called me I couldn't believe it because I put my phone number on the on some cheap receipt and drop it in the lucky draw box so I got a big TV, I don't need to buy one. Yeah, they have a lot of local brands here as well. Then you have here, what is that, Hadhari. And all the cooling stuff here, the ties like the big, even in the condo they don't have a fridge, but they have the big speaker system. Okay, here we come to the, they are pretty loud. When you have a food court or so, you, the, the people put this one here. Uh, I would not recommend for the home. So for the home they use this one it's a uh, 50 60 bucks for a fan okay so next one what do we have here are ah, these air fryers now ah, properly you know them I had one of these and they use 10 times and they break down so I switch now to a big one like this a bigger one you can put even your bird and pork knuckle inside I have a, a pork knuckle put in after an hour was very perfect so this this kind of stuff is so 50 60 uh, 60 to 80 bucks okay they can even buy a smaller one here all right now you have the french fries maker the fryer of course in thailand you need here one row only rice cooker a big rice cooker yeah 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 then a point a special point here where i want to talk about is the the gas stove Although in the regular condos, the gas is not really allowed. So you can really use the small cartridge gas like this. Or when you have a townhouse, you can buy this or this, whatever you need, or more than one. Or halt, you can also get the real stove. What they have here a lot is this table barbecue electric. I have actually many of them because when we have some community barbecue, I'm doing the barbecue. Then you have this, what is it called, shabu, 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 shabu for home. That's actually good because the electricity compares to the price when you go restaurant and you can sit it, at, do it at home, prepared, buy all your stuff, put it here on this one for two, three people. This one is a good size. Otherwise you need a little bit bigger one like this for four people is recommended like this. So they're nice stuff here. And they're only 30 bucks, you see. Actually, the stuff here is much cheaper than in the US. US compared with Bangkok or Thailand. And here, this is hot and cold. No, this hot water. 
then you have a cantina also and the prices are here actually much cheaper really cheaper when I mean make really cheaper I mean okay when you when you need a washing machine front loader you can buy everything in the mall every kind of brand American Euro brand Electrolux but the tires usually they use the, the top loader I have a top loader and it works very fine 12 kilo because I have my two daughters and so you see that's three four hundred bucks uh, shown uh, different so when you want to have a basic life here in Bangkok also you don't need to buy too much expensive stuff but uh, you can do really uh, do very valuable life mean uh, you can see you can buy this freezer box they are actually any kind of size so I you see that's here 9,000 is 300 less than 300 bucks if you look at this and you can put everything inside so you have an inter uninterrupted power supply connected with just in case it will keep running and this is the isolation is six seven eight centimeter here so it's pretty good so the next here bigger one double here big one if you have some dead bodies to keep cool <laughs> no just kidding uh, next one the trick is when you have to buy a fridge in Thailand they're looking here so big no they are not this big because they stand on the pallet here the plastic pallet and they look so high but in real they are not that high oh my god you see for example I have this one here <laughs> da, 19,000 baht 13.5 square and this is good for two adults and like uh, two kids you look you have the egg and the bottle and all this stuff pretty good so that's what you need okay when you want a bigger one you can buy a bigger one the double where you have a left and right door you can get that but then you cannot buy from the retailer here so here's the office stuff now office stuff AC AC there are more fridges that's actually one for 50 15,000 baht I think in the middle they have a lot of oh that's double door like this okay so this one is how much 12 oh yeah okay 12 and then you have down here two doors ah but <laughs> yeah okay looks nice okay for this price is good 500 bucks for a fridge so what do we have next here ah all this office supply Ah, tape and cardboard and you have the files and folders then you have the next one it's shelves when you have an office you need some shelf here yeah 40 50 bucks 60 bucks depends on design uh, quite to the US quite cheap here the stuff here yeah, table white table white plate table whiteboard paper cards all the stuff a lot of paper a pack of 500 sheet paper it's around three bucks here so I recommend double A I don't get paid by the company but I have figured out the quality is quite well and good so when you need a paper you see it's four bucks and you have a 500 sheets of paper I need that for my kids when they do the schoolwork and so on opposite from this uh, what is it uh, office supply you have the ketchup sauce this is actually in some other shops as well he has the uniform we don't need to walk i don't need the uniform you don't need to do wear a uniform here plastic a lot of plastic in thailand then you have here the cooking stuff the pan and pots actually they are not good quality i i they are tin material of course tin very tin they have not done yeah what's called the shoeing this is a big pan if you want to make big fried rice American fried rice or so yeah here yeah, you see this pan actually this is all aluminium and they are 20 to go up to 50 bucks or so but I don't like them I have real cast iron 
the aluminium and the surface doesn't scratch down. And yeah, feel this actually is a good ferry. It's from the brand from the shop here. They make the stainless stuff, and I have all this one. So then you have your cutting board, any kind of size, even wood one, the PVC one. I have the PVC one because you can put hot water over it. It doesn't change anything. Umbrellas, big bottle gallon. But how much here? Plastic boxes. They're plastic. Tough. <laughs> In Thailand, the people like plastic. Actually, here you look. Eh, plastic, plastic, plastic. Yeah, for wash, of course, but I don't like it. This plastic is quite good because it doesn't break when it fell down. And Thai people didn't like. It. Yeah, even this one. They, they're not so carefully like us. You can get, of course, uh, uh, stone or porcelain ware, but yeah. You look, I, I prefer this one. 17 baht for a plate. This is 50 cent for a ceramic plate. This is excellent. I have them and I use them for many years. So, and they broke one or two in all the years. My kids, very, very lovely. And then you can get even the big one. Yeah one plate or even the white one with blue you must just look that's nice here okay it's 60 cent for one plate then you have all this stuff what they have from the restaurant here what i like here is uh this wood when you eat evening tv and you eat some nuts here yeah, or chips it's stylish this wooden it's so lovely it's it's real wood it's not plastic I oh, hear big one. Hey, for my ships. You see that? I love this one. Or when you make yeah, bread plate. Or as we do in German. Brotzeit. Oh, you moi, this is the Brotzeit. Cost halt, uh, I must pay here seven bucks for one. But it's quite good for wood stuff. So, what is the next one? Oh, all oh, here, straw and foam. They want to stop it though, they don't do. They still, they're learning resistant here in Thailand. They have a lot of this plastic stuff and you can buy here, you look, three bucks. <laughs> straws, million straws, how many? I don't know, million, 125 times 10, 1,250 straws. Look at this price, it's only less than two, three dollar, wow. And then, of course, they have also the paper stuff here, that's pretty nice, but quite expensive. Plastic forks and so. Yeah, they have the shirts for some Kran, it's a water game, but they don't allow to splash this here because for the security reason for this, uh, uh, what is it called, the virus. So, here they have the all the action plates in the middle, they put them in pellets. So, what is this? Regular. This is only 45 baht. Take one for my daughter. They love this. They love this stuff. So, secondary. Yeah, they need some, some time, some ships and so. Actually, they live very healthy, you can't believe. My, my older daughter, she loves vegetable and fruits. I'm, I'm happy with that. So, but here, you, now you come million, million and million and million of ships. Millions of ships and all the snack. That's actually the most one is, uh, corn flour and then do some seasoning on it and they sell it here everywhere everywhere yeah popcorn actually actually this popcorn is quite good it has different size but today i don't buy it Yeah, they must always fill up the Thai people love to eat it, especially students. That's why many students now get so overweight, are even more and worse than the US. So this one is one I like. This is actually uh, a corn snack and when you use it with this burrito and snack sauce, it tastes quite good. I don't eat that too much, actually for my kids, I have two daughters as I talk, and therefore I get it. So, 
Then we have here next one is for the mixer, the non-alcoholic stuff. For the mixer, all this colorful stuff. And then here comes the juice, juice, juice. Of course, no single pack. They are all three liter. One liter is actually one dollar fifty. Here the small packs, of course. All the refreshing stuff and coconut. I don't know why they put the coconut in a glass bottle. And so, uh, corn and coconut. Actually, you open the, the, the bottle here, Coke, regular, Pepsi, millions of Pepsi. Ah, Pepsi, 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 small bottles. They like the small bottles. Ah, it makes a lot of garbage, I know. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Swaps, to bad. I need this one, I like this. This is Schweppes lemon or lime. I get usually this one. And then it's quite nice when you put it on ice or with your, what is it? Drink, gin, no, not gin tonic. Vodka, lemon. So we have three items. Now we go back, next one. We're parking our car here. Oh, this is very noisy, you see. So now we need some mac mangoes. Right now it's the mango season. And the mango season means they're quite cheap. Sorry, I must open the deck. Look at these mangoes, wow. You must of course check them as everywhere. No. Yes. Oh, there's even a sticker on it. Look at this, there's a sticker on it. This tells you in Thai language what kind of mango it is. No, it's not born with this. So, one, two, three, four. The trick with these mangoes is you buy them. So, then I put them in my cart and go later to the weight station. So, my daughter likes this, but it's not so sweet. Back. Hmm. They're actually raw, un unripe. But my daughter said that's good, so I buy some unripe mangoes here. As you can see, one, two, three, and good. Here, all the soft drinks, million of soft drinks over there. Promotion girl. They want to animate the people to buy sugar. I need sugar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. Onion, million onions. <coughs> I need also onions. What you have to do? You get your bag, you fill it up, and finally you go to the weight station. Onion, onion, onion. You look, then you got the onion, you check them, push them a little bit if they are nice and Hot, and you must be hot. So, and then we go here. We are now at the weight station. So, this big four onions is 25 baht. Mean the four onion are 60 cent or so. Then we have here, this is 20 baht. 20 baht is 60 cent. <laughs> and then we have the one, two, three, four. Oh, they are expensive, they are two bucks. The 1.6 kilogram is actually less. Ah, it's two bucks, okay. Two US dollar for four, four big mangoes. Ah, I like that. I chew them and later I will eat them. <laughs> So actually the food here in Thailand, when you go shopping, is very, very cheap. So let's see. Here we have watermelon, the sale per kilo. Kilo is 50 cent. Dragon food is 55 baht, mean 1.6 US dollar. Holland papaya, always oh, speak Dutch, huh? I can read that. Map, 
crow Holland <laughs> kilo la one kilogram so one kilogram is a little bit more than one dollar and then they have here more mangoes and more mangoes kangaloo golden lady kangaloo kangaloo melon melon Le melon actually when you take this melons this melon is one US dollar it's quite good you cut it in a half you put it in the fridge for two three days you cut it in half and you eat it also lovely what I need is some pears I need another one. yes the problem here is really about this bag and garbage what I want to get is if they have my fragrance pears oh they don't have it <laughs> Sweet gong here, 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 here. Fragrant here. That's a different one. This off. They tell it off. It's gone, 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 gone. There's mangoes here. What's that mango? That's different mango. Yeah, more mangoes. <laughs> oh my god, so many mangoes. Bananas. What I go here and like in Thailand is all the fresh herbs. Look at this. Thai celery. Morning glory. Now yeah, I don't tell you what it means. Look at this. We have the small pack and it's only 15 cents, 20 cents, 30 cents. Yeah, I buy this one. That's a pack. That's actually a pack. Size, big size. Celery. Kilo, 55 baht, that's it. I eat that, I really eat that. Here you look, I love it. Thailand is good, I love it. And then you have these stuff here. Cabbage, cabbage, cabbage. Less than one US dollar. Yeah, 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 yeah. My celery. But I must walk one time more. <laughs> because that's filled up every day fresh, so don't worry. Yeah, mushroom. 30 cent, one pack, the mushroom. You cut it off here, in the half here, you cut it off the dirt from growing and you have it right to use. So what do we have here? Which? No. I need spring onion, let's see. I love it here, here look at this. All these, uh, all this stuff. One kilo, three bucks. One kilo, here, 19 baht. I, buy the, I, I like to buy them fresh, you see. 150 gram and it's 19 baht. That's pretty good, no? You see, spring onion for 19 baht. This is 60 cents. Yeah, asparagus, you only have the green one. Then here's the mushroom section. You have, of course, lime here, lemon. And you have uh, yellow pepper, green pepper, of course, red pepper. And they are around per kilo, three bucks. Three bucks per kilo is quite good. Then you have the celery here. I will get one. Don't need a big one. Better buy it fresh, you know. Look at this. It's written, of course, in Thai, but it is celery and very green. Ah, I love it. Now I've forgotten my car. <laughs> yeah, my onion. You must check out later again. But let's look for the potatoes. What they, what I really like here in Thailand is one thing is the potato, local potato. Manpalang <laughs> Thai. They're really nice. And this one is local royal product potato. They are nice as well. But today I want to get this one. They're fresh. You must look for your potatoes here. Look at these potatoes. I like them. They're very nice. Look at these potatoes. So, then I have to go back to the wait station. But before, my daughter like cucumbers. 15 baht for two big yeah, cucumbers, two of them, 15 baht. 50 cents for two cucumbers is absolutely cool. They peel it in the evening and they eat it. Of course they eat it. <laughs> Quite funny here, yeah, two packs. 
One dollar, four big cucumbers, quite good. Uh huh. So I go now to the weight station, then we go to the herbs. So, let's see if we have to wait that. Parking the car here. Get my celery and my potato and have to wait. Any Shang Mai? Okay, must wait. I asked her just in Thai. Not you go to the cashier later. So we go then after that to the spice. And I show you the fish, the meat. It's very nice. They have good meat here. And beef, even beef, Australian beef, local beef. Here's all the freezer stuff, French fries. Ready to eat food. Frozen bun. They're quite nice actually, but they, they raise the price on double it. French fries here for you. It's two kilo. It's just five bucks. That is a two kilo bag. So it's quite cheap. Any cutting? Yeah. All the row it's French fries, okay? My potato is 30 baht, one dollar, a hand of potato. My celery is, wow, less than a dollar, 27. I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. That's the cucumber, the fresh stuff coming bun back later. Okay, here we go. Now we walk to the spice. I don't know, I have to look. Actually, I don't need a. Uh, actually, I don't need a shopping list because I memorize everything. So he 